Hello, welcome to Brilliant Performance. Welcome to the weekly walk around. Yes, I know it's Wednesday, so it's not the Monday morning walk around. How are you? Welcome to a Brilliant Performance in Tamworth. It's kind of about nine degrees out there. So it's a bit warmer today, but it's quite cloudy and gray. It's nearly Christmas. We're all getting into the spirit of things. We've not turned the radio off. Losing there, singing. If you have a look, you'll see him in a little bit. And he's like, he's... <laughs> Yeah, so uh, so <laughs> so we're in. The, so Christmas is coming. We've got no deckies up in the shop at the moment, I'm afraid. But you know what? That's not stopping us from being uh, uh, quite excitable about it all. So, welcome, welcome to the weekly walk around. Let's have a quick look around what's going on. Got a few interesting little bikes in there. Some of them not even Aprilias, but we'll have a quick look anyway. So what we got? Okay. Daxes, Groms, Battle Dax, Groms. We've got a V4. Look at the carbon fibre on this bodywork here. This is Kev's bike, basically. Dropped this round. He's just had a little bit of an issue with a block connector on one of the sensors. Fixed within 10 minutes, man. It was a bit of a shame, that one. But Adam's bike, all right, mate. How you doing? Good to see you the other day. Not a problem. That's in just for a little bit of a tickle up afterwards. Okay, we love the Battle Dax. This is the Battle Dax. We've had this floating about any of you that have been up to the shop. We've had this sitting upstairs for a little while now. Just a bit of a project that we've got. We pulled out the other day, finished it. Oh my God, it's Larry. It's basically a little bladder engine in there, 140 bladder engine. It's something that's designed to take about three brake horsepower. It's now got about 30 or something ridiculous. It's, it's scary as hell. Um, auto blippers, looking at auto blippers at the moment. Interesting, we've tried them. Looking at them, quite fascinating watch this space we might do but the nitrous kit's coming out soon for that one i keep saying it don't i but i never actually do it start kicking my ass on that one dan's bike he's just waiting to collect that that's all done not a problem dead easy <laughs> need a new engine we need a new engine for this one the casings are broken on this one so we need to get a new engine for that one you and again your bike's not here still so no drama uh, another gram Bo, how you doing mate i believe you're away driving at the moment but your bike's all done not a problem the um, racing, the Tuono racing. Restoration is coming on really nicely. I am pretty excited about this bike. I pretty much am smitten pretty bad with this as it goes. It's starting to look really sweet. I don't know if you can hear what's going on in the background, but it's the fairy tale of New York. It's dead Christmassy in this workshop at the moment. Right, we've got our race bike, the Nera. The Nera is sold. The Nera is sold, so we no longer have the Nera for sale as it goes. So that's going off to its new home, I believe, next Wednesday. So that's on the bench in a couple of days to get a bit of a look at. We'll be uh, saying goodbye to that, which is a shame because I really wanted to keep that, but never mind. The Nitrous, Nitrous Millie, we've got Kev's bike still here, the 03. Uh, the colour, still got the Edwards, the Edwards for sale. Nobody, nobody has bought this Edwards yet. Very strange. Like I said, I'm open to offers on the Edwards. It's there, ready to go, fully MOT'd. Try me at a price on that one. Just give me a quick shout. Try me. It's cheap, I promise you. Not cheap because it's good, but it's a good buy, but it's cheap prices. Those of you that follow the page, big bore engine build, did you see the dirty valves because of the engine, uh, because of the dirt getting ran by the, by the, uh, by the air filter? That's the engine over there. We're just finishing off the motor over there. Little bit of advice on that one. V-twin air filters. <laughs> What's going on with the music? It's great. I think, is it? <laughs> Pinky and Perky, I think it is, or something like that. Oh, it's the chipmunk, sorry. Alvin, Alvin and the chipmunks, there we go. And it's like squeaky music on the radio, brilliant. Right, sorry, sorry, be professional. <laughs> be professional, right. V twin Gen 2 air filters seating the air filters. Okay, there seems to be a little bit of an issue we found with seating these filters. Um, just make sure they're seated when they go on. There's a little frame that drops over the top that doesn't necessarily help sometimes, as it seems, but, but just make sure it's seated properly. That's why the dirt was around the back of the inlet valve on it. So, have a quick look at what's going on with that. Just whip your airbox lid off, have a quick look and make sure it is. Just keep your eye on what's going on so you can see what's happening. Not a problem. You're about to sort that. Tazzy's bike's got a new wiring loom going on it because that one's causing a problem. I think, pretty much, other than that, do you want to come say hello to Dotty? Let's come say hello to Dotty. Come say hello to little sugar. Here she is. 
Here she is, look. She's got all her duvet wrapped up around her because she's basically, we don't want her getting cold, do we? There you go, baby girl. So if you're coming to the shop, Dottie will look after you, not a problem. Right, thanks very much for tuning in. We'll do our final year because we're closing the end of next week for a couple of weeks. We're going to have a bit of time off over Christmas. So if you want to get in touch, please don't hesitate to get in touch. You can email us at service at aprilliaperformance.co.uk. You can subscribe on the YouTube channel, Aprilia Performance UK. You can leave us a message, get in touch somehow, give us a call at the office, not a problem. The web shop is up and online, running and buzzing. We're updating that every day. In fact, we had some suggestions last week about what to update with that one. The tank kits, the tank cap breather kits for the steel tanks that are getting um, mullered. Fix them, not a problem. That's all up there, up and running, not a problem. Thank you very much for tuning in. Take care and we'll see you soon.